Hey, Bob here, and if you heard, that was my dog snoring in the back. Today's video is going to be a quick and simple one about the Fulton Swing Back Hinge, which helps create a swing back tongue on your trailer, but not so much. It's going to be more about the new American-made swing back or swing hinge that should and is replacing the Fulton manufactured swing hinge. Now, why is it near impossible? In fact, it is. It's impossible to get a Fulton, F-U-L-T-O-N, swing hinge from Fulton itself. They're back ordered and they won't tell you why, but the real reason is because they can't get it from China because they've stopped manufacturing of it. They've had so many disastrous cracks and flaws with the Fulton swing hinge. Um, it, all you have to do is go out and Google on the web. Um, you can Google problems with the Fulton swing hinge, problems with the swing hinge from Fulton, um, boaters issues with the swing hinge, any of that and more is gonna lead you to articles about all the cracking and um, defects with the Fulton swing hinge. Now here's why, I'll show you this real quick. The Fulton swing hinge only has two angel pin drops in here, here and here. So when it folds and goes into this, um, there is not enough support. This hinge right here and the weld itself right here crack. There's just too much stress from hundreds of pounds being placed on this simple hinge and the poor defective weld being made by Chinese manufacturers for Fulton. The, the weld is cracking and the hinges are bending because the weight is too much on the tongue when the trailer is pulling it. So a guy by the name of Troy, who owns Elco Manufacturing, that's E-L-L-C-O, Manufacturing LLC, uh, out of Elwood, Pennsylvania. He read about these articles and all the problems that um, people pulling trailers that had these swing hinges on them that were cracking and, and breaking with Fulton. And he said, well, I run a machine shop. I can do better than that. So here is what Troy at Elko Manufacturing came up with. Let me get out of this and take you to what he did. And I just bought one. I just bought one. Now, that one I just showed you was $89 from Fulton or whoever is the distributor. And there's many distributors of the Fulton swing hinge. My personal opinion, and it's my personal opinion, is you'd be a damn fool to buy a Fulton now take a look at this. This is what Troy at Elko Manufacturing is producing. Notice it has three drop angel slots here, welded. Three here and three here. So you have more support when this swings and closes. You have a stronger pin. It is just a stronger uh, more well-made product. It is a damn good product. So anyway, I just bought one and the price to purchase this with shipping included and taxes was $241. Okay, well, this is, this is steel um, that is machined steel cut out by a laser machine cutout. The Fulton that you just saw, let me get back to that. The Fulton here, this is forged. So all of this housing here is forged steel. Now it's not even good steel because it's made in China. And every piece of this is made in China. 
and because it's forged, it is more subject to break than is the one that is machine. Let me get out of this. The one that is machine uh, made by Elko Manufacturing. So anyway, yes, it's a little bit more expensive. And yes, um, you get what you pay for. So if you, I suggest you go all go out and read about all the failures of the Fulton swing back hinges that are out there and problems that boaters have had. Uh, I had had an order outstanding with Fulton for over a year. Couldn't get it. Nobody can get it. No trailer manufacturer. No, um, no manufacturer of trailers. Nobody who sells trailers can get the Fulton. But Troy... Uh, can and Troy makes them himself here in America totally 100% American made quality um, cut steel welded with extra supports I am gonna get this in a few days I'm gonna put it on and I'll show you when I do but I would suggest my suggestion that you never buy Fulton again and that's my personal opinion you can do whatever you damn well want. Um, I had always concerned myself when I had a C-Pro. I had a big C-Pro that I pulled behind my truck. And I would always hear that, that Fulton hinge creaking. Creak, 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 creak. I don't expect that's going to happen with this Elko manufactured hinge. So you do what you want. But personally, if you're looking for a swing hinge for your boat or trailer, you need to go to Elko Manufacturing. You can look them up, Google them on the web. They have a website. Now, Troy works in his shop, and he uh, is a busy, busy guy. So if you leave him a short, concise message with your phone number, he will call you back. Or you can just send him an email telling him that you'd like to buy a 2x3 or a 3x3 or a 3x4 swing hinge and he will call you back. So, check it out. Anyway, that's Bob out.